Welcome everybody. This is a special 10,000th video. Not 10,000 subscribers. Oh heavens for friend, no. Not even 10,000 posts. No. We are talking 10,000 items inventoried by yours truly. <sighs> yes. Sometime in 2018. I don't have the exact date because the first few boxes I didn't date them, but uh, we have around it box about the 800th item or so was done in October of 2018. So let's say sometime July, August, maybe. I started a Excel spreadsheet of what I have in my vast collection here. Here's the previous, as you've seen in previous episodes. There's palette number one, palette number two, palette number three, palette number four, and palette number five. Plus all the stuff from our previous house. So you can see up there GNT1, that is E-J-O-T. That is the 20th box of graphic novels. Graphic novel, T1 being the first series. I am now up to, oh, number 11. So I've gone through the alphabet 11 times. You do the math, E-J-O, that's 15. So at least 260. I calculate roughly, well, 260, yeah. 260 plus 15, 275 boxes just of graphic novels. There are also, um, as you can see here, C4D, that is, so 75, it's about the 80th box of comics I've gone through. Now, a lot of those on my, on my inventory will say just one line, box number, comics, hang on, see there's another one there, C2Q on there, C2O, those are actually boxes of Sunday comics from the early 90s. Comics Buyer's Guide, remember that? 1994. That's the second run of L. So that's about the 15, that's 26 plus, about the 35th box or so of comics. Now these comics will just have one line on my inventory because later, I will have to go through this whole palette. Yes, remember it was up to the ceiling, just like those over there. You'll see it in the previous videos. This is all comics, folks. And what I have to do, get some friends and family together for an afternoon, put in a few extra leaves on the table, and do like a comics Thanksgiving where we just open boxes, sort them, and then later I will alphabetize them, organize them, and make a better inventory of what's in here. Again, that inventory is going to be more likely Detective Comics 2010 to 2018 or something. Just like you guys, most collectors do it. I won't individually uh, archive them. So, this is my working box here. These are all the graphic novels. Some of these, a good chunk of these. Um, have not yet been inventoried, but they're all graphic novels. They, I will get to that in the coming month, hopefully. As I said, the stuff over here. But again, this is only uh, chest high here. Then, so I'm going to look further back here without falling into a sewer hack. Yeah, so see, that's not too bad. Only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven tiers of kebab of boxes. But then after that, um, we got some posters there. I got some more posters up there. Um, some of these boxes, I probably, I don't know. There's a working area here, which I've got to dig out and uh, organize. Um Another empty box up. Some empty boxes up there. That's nice. I can use those. Um, and just a pet. Someone gave me that Betty Boop. Don't know why. 
There's some comics there. Ooh, yeah, that's the first issue ever of Excalibur. Three bucks, three dollar twenty-five. Claremont, Davis, Neary. Good stuff, my friends. Good stuff. Um, oh, it has an Isman. That's why I put it over there. I didn't know that. It's an actual book. I don't know if they ever sold it to bookstores, but it exists. It was a special issue. Oh, I wonder what that hardcover is here. Mmm, you'll have to wait for that. Yeah, I'll probably never end. There's my yearbook, which should probably be burnt. I'm going to need some special herbs and spices for that. Maybe a full moon. Uh, no, I'm not going to show you my yearbook photo because... Oh, no. Yeah. 1986, it is in there. Um, that would have been my junior, sophomore year. Senior year, I didn't get photos done for obvious reasons. Because why spend all that money getting a studio photo taken if you're not going to hand it up, if you can't trade it to anybody. All right? Ah, yes. So anyway, where was I? Oh, yeah. And then on the other side of this, as you saw, I can't go that way. Oh, I can go that way, but I'll probably end up breaking a leg. Um, do 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 do. Um, I'm not gonna go all the way over, but you can see right there on the other side is a map case or a flat file, flat files folder, flat files cabinet. Anyway, bought that at auction at a warehouse that is now pining for the fjords. Um, And, uh, but that has a lot of flat stuff in it, a lot of big stuff in it. That's probably where the posters are going to go once I, uh, unravel them. And I'll probably do a good feature on those as well. It's just going to take a lot of time to unroll them. But anyway, and then there's a few, well, yes, let's come back here. Most of the stuff is mother. Some stuff on here, stuff I use every, or you're gonna use more often. There's a, oh, good. Uh, Sharpie marker, box cutter. Um, hmm. I was wondering where my laundry went to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. X means it's miscellaneous. Um, in this case, tote pegs, comic tote pegs that I keep. This is from Toronto Quarterly. I don't know which trade show that was, most likely uh, the American Library Association. Uh, here is, and I got a lot of these too. Oh yeah, that's another thing. I've got boxes like this, not boxes, totes like that. This is how I clean up my office. I just tossed them in tote bags, took them home on the subway, about four or five at a time. Um, and then I've got this pile. Here we have comics and mylar. Um, nope, can't show you that one. Naughty, naughty! I know. Um, oh yeah, yeah, this looks fine. Well, so to speak. Um, Evan Dorkin, Slave Labor, it is adults only, but... The cover. <laughs> Excuse me, is, you know, a lot of dust down here. So anyway, guys, and gals, and gender non-specific, or gender undefined, not yet defined. That is where I am right now. So again, thanks for watching. Hope you'll see me real soon. Hopefully I don't get caught underneath a pile of boxes and I find my desiccated corpse a year from now. Surrounded by all the stuff I loved. No, I intend to, uh, well, I'm not going to say because the universe laughs at me. So if I say anything, it's going to say, nope, <laughs> that's what you think. Um, so anyway, hope you'll see me real soon. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, do whatever you want. Just do it with, with fun, excitement. Share what you love. Hope you find somebody else who says, hey, that sounds pretty cool. Tell me more. So there you have it. That's where I am now. And now I got to get back to work. So see you real soon. Bye-bye.